Okay, now we're gonna talk about the full draw position. And this will include the anchor, aiming, and then the transition to the final part of the shot. As the archer comes to the full draw position, they need to come to the anchor. The anchor position is really important because that's what points the arrow. The string needs to be in firm contact with the chin, not just touching the skin of the chin, but touching firmly to the chin bone. And it also needs to be in front of the chin. If the string comes off to the side, then it will cause contact on the release with the chin and cause interference with the oscillation of the string and the flight of the arrow. It's also important for the anchor that you have contact with the jawbone along the top finger and knuckle of the drawing hand. And then this tip of the nose should just touch the string lightly. So you want bone to bone contact with the fingers and the jawbone and tight string to bone contact with the string in front of the chin. At the full draw position, it's really important to make sure that the archer has everything technically correct. The body position at this angle, look at the body posture to make sure that their posture is correct, that the shoulders are set in the proper position, the anchor, the nose, and the draw, so that the archer's in the proper position at the full draw position. At this point also is the only point where they begin to aim. So the archer wants to look at the target through the sight and also look at their string alignment to make sure that the string is lined up in the same place every time, either on the sight or on the bow. It's really important for beginners to de-emphasize the importance of aiming because if they get too caught up on trying to hold the sight on the target, instead of focusing on the shot, it will really interfere with learning a good shot process. So the best way to teach the aiming is just look at the target, thinking of the relationship between the eye and the target, and looking at the target through the sight ring, rather than trying to hold the sight on the target. Also, string alignment's important. Make sure that the string is lined up in the same position every time, either on the side of the sight or on the bow. So from the full draw position, making sure that the archer has everything correct in that full draw position, they will check string alignment, begin the aiming process, and then transition from this position into the final expansion and the shot execution.